This, my friends, is the best rugged smartphone on the market. Stay tuned to the end of this video and you will find out why. My name is JR and you are watching my high speed in-depth review of the ULEF phone AMO 17 Pro. Hello guys, I'm back today with another interesting and special video. Today, I'll be unboxing and reviewing yet another interesting, rugged and AMO smartphone, the ULEF phone AMO 17 Pro, the latest device from ULEF phone. This review is sent to me by ULEF phone, a company that specializes in making rugged smartphones and gadgets. This is the first review I've been receiving from ULEF phone, all thanks to you guys who have been supporting this channel by subscribing, liking and sharing. In order to make sure you have a good viewing experience, I have included a timestamp to help you navigate through the entire video with ease. Also, be sure to watch my review of the Doji S61 Pro and the Okitel WP19, another rugged device you should consider if you are in the market for a rugged smartphone. So, if this is your first time on my channel, you are welcome. I do tech reviews on this channel where you can support me by subscribing, liking and clicking on the bell icon so as not to miss out on future videos. This will also help increase my chances of getting more products for review. So without further ado, fasten your seatbelt and let's dive into the content of today's video. In front of me are two boxes. Inside the first box, we have a protective case, a belt clip and a lanyard. Inside the second box, we are greeted with a paper box which houses the user manual some paperwork and a screen protector. Further inside the box, we have the phone, a Type-C to C cable, a wrist lanyard, a 66 watt PD Plus fast charger and a SIM ejection tool. Let's go ahead and remove the plastic wrap. The unit I have is the AJB plus 256 GB black variant that features a 6.5 inches fluid display with a 1080 by 2400 Hz plus resolution, a 20 to 9 aspect ratio, a triple camera setup and a tough body build. It is packed with a 5380 mAh battery that can last up to 9 days on standby and 2 to 3 days on normal use. It supports 66 watts PD Plus fast charging and can charge from 0 to 38% within 10 minutes. Surprisingly, it also supports 15 watts reverse and direct wireless charging. In terms of connectivity, this device is capable of 4G and supports all global band networks. It's packed with Wi Fi, Bluetooth 5, and NFC, which supports Google Pay. On the front, we have a 16 megapixel camera setup and a front facing speaker. On the left, we have a customizable button and a SIM card SD card slot which can accommodate up to 3 SIM cards. On the top, we have the microphone. On the right, we have a non split volume rocker and a power button which also doubles as a fingerprint sensor. On the bottom side, we have the speaker grills, Type C charging port, microphone, and a headphone jack. On the back, we have the brand logo, 3 camera setups which includes the main camera night vision camera, wide angle camera, two infrared lights, flashlights and a well finished carbon fiber design. This device is IP68 and IP69 certified with thickness, height and width of 12.5mm, 172.7mm and 80.4mm respectively. It weighs about 290 grams and this is one of the lightest rugged smartphones I have reviewed on this channel. Overall, I think the build quality is awesome. Let's go ahead and boot up this device. On first glance, we can already see this device comes back to Google Service Pro installed which is very impressive considering it's a Chinese smartphone. The screen feels very smooth, fluid and bright thanks to its 2K Full HD Plus resolution, 120Hz refresh rate and 240Hz sampling rate. This device comes back to Android 12 running on the MediaTek Helio G99 Ultra Core processor and 8GB of RAM. The fingerprint and face unlock of this device are pretty fast and I'm impressed with it. On this menu, the side button can be configured to open applications like maps and contact lists or perform other operations like turning on flashlights, SOS calls and voice recording. This device comes packed with some impressive measurement tools which are present in most rugged smartphones. This includes compass, height meter, plumb knob, projector and more. I will be telling a lie if I say I am not impressed with the display on the ULEF phone AMO 17 Pro. It is the best display I have seen so far on a rugged smartphone since I started reviewing rugged smartphones on this channel. In a nutshell, it is freaking awesome. While I was editing this video, I received another product from ULEF phone. This product is a mini magnetic Bluetooth speaker and you guys will be unboxing it with me for the first time. Stay tuned to the end of this video and you will find out how you can get this phone for 70 USD. My name is JR and you are watching my 6 minutes in-depth review of the Doji S61 Pro. I think it's a great mini speaker. It sounds pretty good and it is MagSafe compatible, which means it is able to stick to the back of your iPhone or any device that has a MagSafe. And with a 10 hour play time, I don't think your party will be ending anytime soon. This device comes equipped with a 108 megapixel main camera. 
8 megapixel night vision camera and a wide angle camera. As always, rugged smartphone isn't considered rugged enough on this channel if it doesn't have a night vision camera. And Yulo phone didn't disappoint. They have done a great job by including a night vision camera on this device. I spent some time exploring the cameras on this device and I think the performance is good. Although, the night vision photos on this device is not as clean as those produced by the Doogees, but it definitely pulls some strings. The images produced on this device are great and you can shoot videos on 2K, 1080p Full HD, 720p HD and 420p VGA. It's important to note that there isn't any inbuilt image stabilization, which means the stability of your shots depends entirely on you. Overall, I'm impressed with the camera performance I must say. I tested this device on a total version 9.2. I checked the temperature before and after the process and I'm very impressed with this call. Its performance experienced a big increase when compared to other rugged smartphones I've reviewed on this channel. Overall, I think the performance is solid. The first question that comes to mind is, who needs this kind of smartphone? If you are a person who is interested in long lasting battery, night vision cameras, fast charging technology and a strong body build capable of surviving any kind of harsh weather, then this is the go-to phone for you. It is also important to note that the ULEF phone Amo 17 Pro has an expandable storage of up to 1TB. The price is also quite affordable, it starts at 224 USD and is currently available on AliExpress. More information on that in the description below. Finally, we have come to the end of today's video. I really hope I was able to give you a good review and I would love to see your comments in the comment section about your thoughts on this video. If you found this video helpful, let me know by giving it a thumbs up, tweet it, share it. And if you are interested in more smartphone and smart device review, consider joining the community by hitting the subscribe and notification button. Thanks and see you next time.